All right, guys, we have this Joy Move squeeze flap mop and bucket system. I'm getting ready to show you guys here. Yes, the mop is in here. This is really cool, easy to use. Uh, I got it on my table, guys. I'm just showing you from here versus on the floor because my back is actually uh, a little sore right now. So uh, I, that's even more reason why I'm going to show you why it's uh, awesome using this. Uh, no bending over and all of that. So uh, this company sent it to me, guys, to share with you guys what I think about it. So thank you to them uh, for sending it to me. And I actually have one of their other uh, mop bucket systems and I absolutely love it. So let's get into it. All right guys, giving you all a closer look at it. So right here, you can see on here, it shows you, it shows this is the drying uh, component area here. This is the wash area here. So right here on the sides guys, right here, and here's where you unlock it. So all I would simply do is pull it right here and pull it up from the back. And that takes the lid off. Now, once I have the lid off, Inside of here, this is the actual mop. And you get two more mop pads. So you have three mop pads in total because one is right here. And these are the microfiber mop pads, guys, where they easily can come off and they stick on here. So you can see, all you simply do is take it off with the traction here, put it on, make sure it's lined up really good. A quick uh, tip for it as well guys making sure it's flat flush and even is to wet this before you take it through the uh the mop bucket system because it'll just make it easier uh to go through where it's not going to get jammed up and keep it intact right and a great thing about this mop guys is that it's a one click where once you lock it in all you got to do as i'm going to show you is just you can just slap it up shows you this way up right here you can click it up with your foot or if you want to use your hand you can but easily that locks it uh in place to be able to ring out and go through the system and then to lock it down uh, when you're actually using a mop. And what I love about this mop system, guys, you can use it on your floors, uh, you can use it on walls, however you want to use it, and you can get it as wet as you want to have it as dry as you want. So if you want a less wet floor when you're cleaning, you can control that with how many times you just simply wring it out. It's easy as that. So let's go ahead and show you the mop, put it together, and then show you it in action. What I love about this, like I said, guys, my having some uh, soreness with my back right now, so bending over is not something I'm really trying to do like that. And and, and stand more upright so I can easily use this with wringing it and cleaning it without having to bend, okay? So this is how you put this together. All it is, easy click in place with these poles. All you're gonna do is one after the other like this. So this one here at the top. Like I said, I have one already, guys, that I love. So this is another one I got. Uh, it works that good. And all you do is twist the poles and tighten it up. And then from the view, you can see it a little bit here. Right here, something on my couch with it. This is the length of the mop. If you want to shorten it up, you can actually take one of the poles out and make it shorter. But I know what I was telling you guys, it shows you this way up. You see that how it snaps in place and when it's time to mop, you just put it down with a click of your hand, your foot, whatever, when you're standing up and you're good. Uh, the, it's a max line in here, guys. So this is where you want to fill the water up uh, to this max line. You want to do that because it can completely fill, uh, get the entire uh, mop wet. So you want to do that. And that's all it is to it. So let's check it out in action. All right, guys. So here it is. You can see I have the system all set up, filled it up with water, have it locked in. I got it on the dry side right now. And just showing you all. Also, just to show I'm not BS, and here is the other one right here that I have. So yes, I do have uh, another one of these. So all you do, guys, you go here, okay? You put the mop in. This is on the wet side, as it says. You can see I got it soaked up however I want it little too wet all i got to do is put it on the dry side wring it out a little like that that's all it is to it i go over here to the floor put it on the floor i can just push it down like that and from here you just get the mop and as you can see i can control how wet i want it how dry i want it and just go to work on the floor guys so i love these microfiber cloths uh that you use and when you're done just even with my foot push it that way up as you can see here when you're done all you have to do guys you can throw these in a washing machine and reuse them okay uh they work great uh they do recommend replacing them every uh couple of months i believe but listen for uh a easy simple mop system as you can see i did not use my hand to touch there's no ringing out easy to use didn't have to bend over at all uh so yeah this is a great system i love the joy moot products uh, I highly recommend it, guys, and I'm uh, going to get to work on this floor. So if you've been looking at this product, hope this video was helpful to you.